Uh, hi everyone, this is attorney Ayhan Agment. What do we suggest them to do during their visa appointment at the U.S. consulate to be able to get the J-1 work and travel visa? So what they should be doing to make sure they actually can get the visa. What I did it earlier, I asked actually the representative of work and travel uh, program that is your follower follows that... Um, do you have any suggestions before I say anything? Because I know in a practical matter, you're involved with this and you're helping those so many students to do this. So his answer was, he thinks and he says, um, the work and travel program visas are one of the easiest visas to get um, because all your applications or, or file is being prepared and ready beforehand. And all you have to do is relax during the appointment, you know, act it in a way that, uh, you know, that the counselor can approve your visa. I think that's a perfect answer. Uh, and and I wanted to give you a chance to tell what you're going to tell because which is, I think, important. Uh, and I'm verifying that. You're definitely right. Uh, secondly, what I could tell is this. The point is here, the type of visa you're going to get, uh, it ba basically uh, has requirements. So... And one of the most important requirement of the part in that is you have a sponsor company, right? Or sponsor involve approving your DS form. So when there's a sponsorship and then that sponsor approves you to get the J-1 visa, and that means you're being actually analyzed, your requirements being checked by them. So it's something like an initial check before the council gives you visa you have been proved and it has been passed. So that's why I agree with you when you say it's one of the easiest because its requirements show that sponsored company, sponsor involved in this J-1 actually has approved that applicant. So that kind of gives the higher chance of getting visa and the purpose is out there and which is temporary during the summer and then it's going to be great experience for applicant. I agree with you. What's going to become more important that the consulate it's going to see and believe that the person is really going to be there temporary. If that's the case, you will get the visa. You'll, you'll be able to come. What I will recommend that students like you to make sure their grades are good in their school. Keep your grades high. Do good at work and in your school. That's also going to show that you're a good student. And it's going to show them that you definitely have a school that you want to come back. So um, that's why I think uh, the representative of work and travel organization also, they also say good, uh, uh, you know, I think I agree with them. So that would be the, my answer.